Okay, this is a quick demo of how to create Apple Notes automatically from scans. Uh, you know, you one button press on your scanner, scan comes into your computer, automatically goes into Apple Notes and creates a new Apple Note. And I'm going to demo this right now. So I'm going to take a, an incoming scan, which in this case will just be a file that I paste. And we're going to go into my notes inbox, which is just a simple folder on my computer. I'm going to paste in that image and you can see immediately I get a new Apple note and that new Apple note has the image attached to it. And it has a little bit of a note, like uh, what day I scanned it, the name of the file, and that's it. So the reason I did this is because I just helped my mom migrate 20,000 notes. Yes. 20,000 notes from uh, Evernote over to Apple notes. And that was a big job, uh, it went beautifully, everything's working great. The one thing that was missing was the ability for her to, what she used to do previously was press a button on her ScanSnap scanner, and it would automatically import a scan directly into Evernote. So she didn't have to drag, drop, or do anything like that, it just showed up. And I wanted to do the same thing with Apple Notes. So what I did was I said, we'll, we'll take a folder in Finder, or in this case I called it Notes Inbox, and anything that goes into that notes inbox will automatically become a file in Apple Notes with an attachment. And you can see here, so actually, let me get rid of this folder here. Um, so I've got that notes inbox here. And then uh, the other part of this is that I wrote a script and the script is called notes inbox as well, but the name doesn't matter. Uh, it's pretty short. All it does is it just watches that folder in Mac OS. And then anytime a scan or a file of any sort shows up, so as you saw, you can just like paste in as well. Um, anytime a file shows up in that folder, it'll automatically create a new Apple note. And then it actually deletes that, that file in Finder as well. So it keeps things tidy, which is always a good thing. So let me show you how to install it. Uh, first of all, I'm going to include a download link below. Uh, I'll post this on GitHub. This is an Apple script file. So I just open it up in Apple script. You'll download it. And then this file, you can name it whatever you want. I call it notes inbox. Uh, you can put it inside of your folder actions scripts folder. Where is that folder? Let me show you where that is. So the way that you uh, I'll open up a new uh, finder window here, a new tab. And the way that you get to it is in finder. The easiest way is to press command shift G. And that brings up this uh, navigate to folder dialog and we'll navigate to the home library. You can do this on the root level library if you want to install the script for all users on your computer but I only need it for myself, so it's easy. I'll type tilde, which means home, slash, library, slash, scripts, slash, and then there's folder action scripts. You can see it right there. You can just cursor down, and then I'll hit enter. Now, I've already installed the script here in this folder actions folder. So it's notes inbox. You'll just save it or copy it into this folder. And you can also customize a couple things. There's some configuration. So for instance, there's a note prefix option. If you want to prefix every note that it creates with something like scan or incoming or something like that, you can just add some value there. And then the notes folder is the name of the folder in Apple notes that it will save things into. So for me, that's inbox. Um, you could call it scans, whatever. And if that folder isn't inside of Apple notes, when the script runs for the first time, it will create it for you. All right. Now that that's done, I'm going to go back here and let's simulate creating a new folder and adding this, attaching this folder action to it. This one notes inbox has already got it attached. So we'll do it from scratch. Uh, so I will do command shift N to make a new folder. We'll call this scans inbox just so it's different. And then I'm going to right click or two finger click in this case on that folder, go down to services menu and choose folder actions setup. And then folder action setup will ask, Hey, can I run the service? You say yes. And it will then ask you what script to attach. You can choose the notes inbox script that is already in that folder because you added it, choose attach and you are then done. And now if we go, let's go grab our whale image, copy that. In fact, let's go over to Apple notes first and delete this so that we can easily see if things are working. So I'm going to copy that whale image. We're going to go back to scans inbox paste it in just like it's a PDF coming in from my scanner or a JPEG coming in from the scanner. And there it is in Apple notes. So if you have any questions about how it works, let me know. It's, I mean, pretty simple, but it, it's a weird gap that wasn't, uh, I couldn't figure out how to easily do it with any of the existing software solutions or scanning uh, software solutions. So I figured this might be useful for other people as well.